You know, Derek James, his coach, uh, a lot of people are saying, you know, he was saying that he had to fly out to London the next day. Mm -hmm. A lot of people saying that he, you know, he, he, he spread himself too thin. You know, now that this loss has happened, you know how the naysayers yeah, are going to yeah, say. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. He got too many other things that he focusing on outside of Earl Spence uh, Jr. What do you say to that? I mean, do you feel the same way or do you feel like his total focus is as it's always been? I don't have a I don't have a comment about that. No comment. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we going to talk. You, you, like I said, you, you went on the internet to clear the air the other day. Me, I don't know why people think me and Earl got something. Clear this up. Nothing has happened. I'm tired of people acting like something happened between me and this brother. Mm -hmm. You don't, it, it, it ain't nothing, we ain't had no issues whatsoever, and, and I get it, but for no excuses, no reasoning, just I'm not working with you no more, basically, and now you standing on the outside looking in, Mm -hmm. You guys be around each other. You don't ever have. You never asked him. I've I've never asked him. You know, of course, it be in my mind. Like I, I would be lying if if I. And, you see what and, I'm saying? I'm not being real if I don't wonder why. I've always wondered why because I feel like, you know, we 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 had like I was. I feel like I was sugar. To, I was a sugar to the Kool Aid. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But outside of that, then we had a personal relationship. So you know, was it his the total decision, or is it like I have, the organization? I have, you know what I mean. I have. It no, might not just be listen, his decision. People been asking me this for years, and I always say, y'all got to go talk to EJ. Mm -hmm. I got to talk to Earl. I'm not the one because if he want me to train him, you know what I'm gonna do. Yeah. I'm pulling up. Because what I look at is that a fight this huge and a fight that was going to be this, you know, um, career defining, right. Mm -hmm. That you have shown so much success with him over all of the different, um, people you've dealt with. Right. Facts. Like why wouldn't he pull for you more than anybody else? That's the part that is baffling to is, me. Listen, I don't listen to this day. I'm trying to tell you, I have no idea. You don't like know what you, said, done, what you done wrong. You don't know what you done well, wrong. I didn't do nothing wrong. How well, you, uh, how you, you done listen, wrong? How you gonna do something? Earl ain't did nothing. You listen, done something wrong. Listen, how, you, go. how you gonna do something wrong when y'all undefeated together? Good work. Right. And y'all never the, lost together. The world sees how strong and how powerful he was when me and him worked together. Make it make sense. You and him undefeated together. You've never, he's never lost a fight, of course, dealing with you. Go look at the fights. Damn. I'm upset, you know, because I, I would have loved to see your conditioning and him in the ring with Bud Cross. And then you got to think about it. Like I said, bro, when all the fights that I tried him, we didn't use weights. You know what I mean? And I... I never had a hundred percent of control of what we done while we was training. So I was handicapped while I was training him and we still got those results. No try I don't believe another training in this world could have certain exercises that you're allowed to do and can't do, and you still gonna get those results training somebody. Wow. Man, I, you 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 blowing my mind with the with with things that, that you're saying because Something had, you know, something had to be a, a happen for us. Maybe not on your part, but the team. Somebody said something. You know what I mean? Well, I want to ask you mm -hmm. more questions, but I, I got a question. Uh, hold if on, something, you can't listen, just get back in here and ask a question. You listen, don't wait. Listen, I'm gonna tell you saying? something. Anybody, anybody that know, listen, anybody that know Traylon Curry, they'll tell you I'm a real, I'm solid man. I'm from the street. I'm not from no fitness. And where I come from, anybody put my name on say they gonna tell you, nah, he a hundred, he's solid. So you know already it wasn't that you was straight up and down on your side on listen, every point. Listen, man, listen, listen. Earl, 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 no. I, anytime he needed me, I pull up. And he needs you now, you pull and, it up. And, 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 yeah, of course I'm pulling up. It's not even a question. We, we don't went out hunting together. Come on, man, I'm a soldier, bro. No, I, like, okay. real talk. One, two, three, four, five. Up top. Up top. Up top. All right, and, and, I, and I get it, man. But, you know, Derek James, his coach, uh, a lot of people are saying, you know, he was saying that he had to fly out to London the next day. Mm -hmm. A lot of people saying that he, you know, he, he, he spread himself too thin. 
you know, now that this loss has happened, you know how the naysayers yeah, are going to yeah, say. Yeah, for sure. Yeah. He got too many other things that he focusing on outside of Earl Spence uh, Jr. What do you say to that? I mean, do you feel the same way or do you feel like his total focus is as it's always been? I don't have a I don't have a comment about that. No comment. Well, I can people y'all he won't he won't you know I love this part. You know no comment. No comment. Oh man. So when have, you go ahead. Have there been other people who reached out to you to train them? Oh yeah, for sure. But oh yeah, yeah, for sure. I've trained other like you know other fighters. You know what I'm saying? Oh, no, like, I'm talking to that level. That no, 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 like, no. Well, no, no, not not on Earl level. No, 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 no. Okay. Would, is it something that you wouldn't take because of the relationship with you and Earl that you wouldn't even take it? For sure. You see what I'm saying? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like yeah, certain, certain, got, you yeah know, there's certain people I won't train because of Earl, for sure. Because okay. you and Earl have such a unique uh, relationship mm -hmm. and you can't be over here looking like, like you Even if me and Earl never train again another day, it's just certain people I wouldn't deal we with do it. because I'm loyal to a fault. No, and I, I agree with that. I'm built like that. I agree with that so much. You know much. what I'm saying? Man, I... You know, it would, you know, it, you know. I enjoy it, man. Like I said, I just know that you know, there's 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 things that you as a uh, you know fitness trainer when run, leading up to a fight, the 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 uh, you know the trainer that basically is in there with him, um, the team around him, mental states, all that stuff yeah. has to do with this fight, yeah. building up the momentum to say we going in here to do this or that. Uh, big extra plug comes out. Mm -hmm. Uh, the music is off just a little bit, as I keep saying. Yeah. Uh, to me, Earl didn't look the the, the way he normally looked for me. Yeah. Um, when I hear the song "Lose Yourself" with Eminem, and I look over there at Bud Crawford, he looks like he's focused like hell. To be yeah. honest with you. Yeah, he did. He got a damn fish net on his own, and he's saying, you know, it's go time. And before he got in that ring, he prayed. I said and watch this man pray. Take his time. Pray. I seen him. Listen, bro. I'm gonna be honest. You watched the fight. You I seen, seen listen, that part. I seen. I seen him when I seen Bud say Jesus Christ openly, bro. I, I I'm gonna keep it a hundred. I had a new respect for him. You see what I'm saying? I'm a believer in Jesus Christ, hands down. You see you know what, what I'm saying? saying? And I seen him give props to Jesus Christ like that openly in front of the world. I was I was like Cause I we res know I respect that. Mm -hmm. We know people ain't gonna do that, man. I respect I'm a, that. Now I'm keeping it a hundred. I respect that for sure. See, but I believe that everything happens for a reason, and that's the same thing I said in my last interview. And you know, yes, everybody's upset of him having a loss and what he has to go through, but we all have to go through things so we can get better. Yeah, for so sure. So we can be who God intended us to be. Mm -hmm. You understand what I mean? I totally agree. So, do you have a game plan? If Earl Spence was to call you, Earl Spence Jr. call you right now and say, "We got to go to work." I got to be ready by December. Could you put a game plan together to make him the most uh, the, the, the most ready to go fighter that you have ever seen within the within under a six months or five month period? You see what I'm saying? You gonna disrespect me like that? I'm just asking you, man. <laughs> the people need to know. We need to hear it come out your mouth. Listen, men lie, women lie, numbers, numbers don't. don't lie. Of course, I can get them in. This. Listen, I'm, listen, that's what I do. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gon' talk.